All right, I'm gonna start this video by reading a tweet shared by Music Entrepreneur Club on Instagram from Key Opens Doors, who is 21 Savage's manager, if you don't know Key. And she said, there are millions of talented artists, millions. Labels and distributors are investing in the ones who have great teams. Now, I can say, it takes maturity to truly, truly understand this. And when I say maturity, like in, in how you see things, but a lot of that comes from experience. Now, I used to be around a lot of investors who were working in startups. And I would hear one of the primary things they would say is, I'm investing in the entrepreneur. I'm investing in the team, not the business idea. And over time, I see why that's so important, all right? Because people who are experienced, they understand that problems can and will happen, all right? When you have insight into the game, you know that's a part of the game, but how will the team handle it? Can the team handle it? And what resources do they have beyond me to help them handle it? Those are very important questions to ask because everybody knows there's a high failure rate when it comes to businesses. Everybody knows, right? There's a high failure rate when it comes to the success of an artist. There's so many artists that wanna that wanna blow up. Very few do, comparatively, right? So when you know that's gonna happen, the storm will come. You wanna ship that can weather the storm. That team is the thing that helps, right? That dictates the decision making, that dictates whether or not you're able to move fast, move slow, and do everything necessary to get the job done. And if I'm investing in you from a label, distributor, right? Just a time standpoint, I want to make sure I increase the chances of my return and not having certain things in place decreases the, the probability of success and me getting the return that I want. All right? Now, a couple things that that people constantly say, but I wanna add to it with some personal things that I've seen. People always talk about capital, right? Money. People talk about capability, the skill set. Do you have some skills and do you have connections? Capital, capital capability, connections. I'm gonna throw another C on there though. Commitment, all right? Because there's been so many times where I really start to break things down and understand if the people with the most control have the least commitment, and that's typically the artists because they are the primary driver in terms of the product, and then you have whoever else on the team that might have some level of, of control. It depends on your team. If the people with the most control have the least commitment, you might as well wash your hands with this. I've seen people, uh, situations, very real situations where a guy had so, so, so much money. I'm talking about capital is not a question. Not a question at all. But his attention is on so many things. The music industry is not what he's living and breathing. It's an extra, right? It's a, it's a cherry on top. It's a trophy. And because of that, when real things occurred, we saw smaller successes than we should see. And working with so many teams, right? That's what I get to see all the time, the impact of the team, all right? Um, and when you don't have the commitment, you'll move on to another thing to get you a quick high, all right? Because you're not committed to this situation working out. You're just happy when things are going well. Once things are going bad over here, you're going to go to something else, try to get that hit. Uh-oh, well, things are going well over here again. Let me go back over there. And that's not what is required to get to the, the next level. It takes the focus and being there when it's bad and when it's good. Now, Many other situations, a, a hothead manager ruining a, situ, uh, a situation that involved more than just a team, it involved a, another team. It was a collaborative effort. And I'm talking about music that did very well, right? Well, things that we were like, yo, this thing popped and people look, look at it as a song that popped. However, knowing, being on the inside, this thing could have did hundred times better, literally, but it got ruined by the team, right? Pe that's why people will say, I don't like their manager. I don't want to work with them because a lot of managers will, a lot of managers will ruin situations and not, and the artists won't understand that the manager is the reason people won't work with them. The manager is the reason they got less money than they think they should have got. They could have got more with a different manager or maybe not even involving the manager, 
right? Because that's, <laughs> but you, but it's hard to see that at times, right? Um, so how can I put this together? Just, I, I, I want to make sure. All right, let's add a, a five, a fifth C, right? We got capability, right? We got capital, we got connections, we got commitment, but we also know conducting yourself accordingly, all right, is a very important thing. I'm not saying being a pushover, but how a manager handles things can literally ruin a situation. How a team handles things can literally ruin a situation and start to pigeonhole you. And all of a sudden you'll get rid of a manager or somebody on your team. And just like getting rid of a bad relationship and your life gets better, all of a sudden a whole bunch of people want to work with you. And you're like, yo, where were y'all back then? I didn't know that y'all like mess with me like that. Well, we ain't like your manager, you know, it, like it just is what it is. So please understand this, that your team matters in so many more ways than you might give credit for. All right. Uh, and an investor, a label, a distributor is not just looking at you. They're looking at the, the, the business that they are investing in. And that goes beyond you. You are a product. Their goal is to invest in a small business and accelerate its growth to get the return that they desire. If you don't have your business in order, better invest in somebody else. That's how they think. That simple. Your team does matter. Understand these elements as an entrepreneur in the business. All right. And make sure you move accordingly. So that's it for this video. But I want to add two other videos on team. I'm going to do one read through of the comments and add context. So I'm going to put that somewhere over here or, or over there. And there's another video where I'm gonna break down the, or I've already broken down, so check it out. It's gonna be over here or over there. I'm breaking down what the modern team should look like for an artist. Check those videos out, click through. Hope, believe this was helpful. Let us know if there's more questions you have in the comment section below. Peace.